Good afternoon. Sitting here in traffic. I'm waiting for everybody to move down to one lane. Everybody wants to run up in the right lane right before they're supposed to get over and then they get all you know irritated because you don't get over for them uh, or you don't let them in. So anyway, today I thought I'd I get questions. I see a lot of uh, beginning handyman ask, uh, hey is uh, Home Advisor a good place to get leads? Is uh, porch a good place? Is Thumbtack a good place? Uh, so I thought I'd talk a little bit about uh, each of those. I've um, I've spent money with each of them, and I have my my uh, opinions on them. So uh, and I've had several service businesses uh, in the past, and I've used some of them uh, with those businesses as well. And so, this is uh, my experience with them. Uh, first off, Home Advisor used to be called Service Magic. Uh, Home Advisor still calls me, even after I've told them to stop calling me. Uh, they continue, so I get um, I get a little irritated because they call me. And go, hey, hey, Donald, we got a whole bunch of handyman people looking for handyman and. Your area, uh, if you're just uh, advertised with us, uh, we'll, we'll send all these leads to you. <clears throat> sure you will. Um, when I was with Home Advisor, um, and I was also with them years ago when they were Service Magic, I got leads that led to nowhere. Uh, paid money, good money for those leads, still got nowhere. Uh, if you go out on the internet, Facebook or a uh, uh, construction or any service uh, forum and ask them what they think of home advisor don't take my word for it ask them uh, because I just hadn't had uh, nothing but spend a lot of money with them and got nothing in return so and look at their reputation I, I think right now they're I could be wrong so go to Google and look them up I think right now they're involved in a class action lawsuit not sure what it's about but you know hey go look it up don't take my word. Go to Google. Ask people uh, that are, are uh, use them what they think. Uh, porch. Uh, porch I really thought was going to do good for me because uh, they're they're associated with Lowe's, and so I signed up with them. I got they gave me a hundred dollars free leads, and wow, are they proud of their leads? Uh, having said that, I went through that $100 lead and never got one bit of business. Here's the problem with Porch. Just this morning, I get a, a lead request that somebody wants 35 windows replaced. And Porch wants to charge me $52 for that lead. Now, that's not a guaranteed thing. If you don't get that, you just spent $52. Wow, porch. And I told them when they called, seriously, people, you are way overpriced on your leads. Because what happens, and I've seen this more than once, that same person will put a request in with porch, then they will go to Thumbtack, put in a, a request, and, and on Thumbtack, it may only cost me six or seven dollars. And then they'll go to Home Advisor and put in another request. And come find out, they're just kicking tires. They just want to see what cost to replace windows or doors or whatever the request uh, that they're sending so that's my my problem with porch i'm still a member with them and i'm they're just really high on their leads and it's no guarantee that you get those leads uh so i'm not crazy about porch because they think that these people who are sending requests are only using porch and it's not uh, i can't tell you how many times i've got a porch lead and then see the same person send one in thumbtack uh, so let's go on to thumbtack thumbtack um, really hasn't been that great for me either been better than porch and home advisor by far but that's not saying much um, I get about one out of ten or maybe even twelve leads and the thing about people who use these services, most of them are looking for the cheapest uh, 
vendor or in our case the handyman they're looking for the cheapest they can get something done so going back to the lead thing okay $52 lead let's add you know I did get it for three windows um, and you know I, I get about $125 a window if it's a standard install uh, brick or something it's going to look a little bit more but let's you know let's say I'm you know that's what 250 375 something okay that's still if you, even if you make 400 off those three windows man that is uh, what uh, is that about uh, pop my head I'm really moving now <laughs> once I started making video traffic started moving so you know it's really a lot for a lead they figure you're going to make you know these companies are tied in they know what a uh, about what a job will pay so they're going to try to get a good portion of it I don't play that game so back to Thumbtack um, I've had I got a few jobs off Thumbtack not a whole lot but most of these people who use these services are looking for the cheapest uh, contractor or handyman that they can. That's the problem. And I don't like paying for leads from people who are, you know, I hate to say it, but not all of them, but a lot of them are just cheap. You know, um, you know, you go back to the lady looking for window install, you know, if I quote her 400 bucks, you know, she may take it or she may go, oh. I, you know, she may, may come to realize that, hey, those three windows don't need to be replaced all that bad. And so, therefore, that's the problem with these lead generation ser uh, services. Uh, all the leads, uh, you know, I, I think some of them uh, mislead consumers. And at the end of the day, they're trying to make a buck off us. You know, they need to be making a buck. And I, uh, I could throw Angie's List in there. Um, I, you know, everybody's trying to make a buck off us. If you see my other video, and I'll post a link up here, you know that uh, there's, I think, a lot better places to advertise free. Now, I will tell you, all, if you've got a, uh, well, even if you have a face, just a Facebook page, but if you got a website, AdWords on Google uh, is something that has really worked well for me. But I'll warn you, you can you can spend a ton of money with AdWords and not get nothing. You've got to know how to do AdWords, and I don't have time to tell you. Uh, you need to go out there, and, but if you know how to work it, AdWords works very well. Um, it's, it's something I will spend money on if I need the leads. Fortunately, I get a lot of referrals, and I just don't need it anymore. So, anyway, I just um, I just wanted to touch on that. I was sitting in traffic for a long time. I was like, hey, let's make a video. As soon as I started making video, hey, traffic moved. So, maybe I'll keep that in mind from now on. So, anyway, y'all, uh, keep it real. This video is getting uh, eight, nine minutes now. So, I just wanted to uh, throw that out there, guys. Um, spend your advertising money wisely. And I'm just not a big fan of these lead generation services, especially a couple of them that uh, you know, either they promise a lot and don't deliver, or in case of porch, I, I think porch, you know, would be, if it was priced like Thumbtack, it would be all right. But man, when you start talking, no, I've seen some leads for a siding, you know, over a hundred bucks. You know, I'm sorry, I don't gamble. But if I was wanting to gamble, I don't think I'd throw it at porch. I think I'd go casino, you know, so, uh, I mean, if it was guaranteed, yeah, guaranteed. I'll shoot you, a, you know, three, four thousand dollars siding job for hundred dollars if you guarantee it. But they ain't gonna guarantee it. So that's the problem. They they promise a lot, but they don't deliver. So anyway, hey, like and subscribe down there. Yes, I took my hand off the wheel. So anyway, like and subscribe because I took my hand off the wheel for y'all, nobody else. And uh, hey, put this on your playlist and. Uh, Oh boy, looks like we might have another backup up here. So, anyway, I'm going to get off here and drive. Uh, hey, it's coming up on Christmas. Y'all have a good Christmas. Remember the reason for the season and be kind to one another. Donald out. Blue collar DIY.